the memorizer body, it reduces the effect of, for example, flying on a plane, jet lag, and traveling on electric trains. Because our belief is that artificial electromagnetic fields have an influence on the cell communication, either humans, plants, and animals. And massive um, exposure to artificial electromagnetic fields has also a negative effect on cell communications and uh, how cells behave. And um, we just published a study in the United States from a professor Darch, he's a professor in Germany, uh, biology and chemistry, uh, that what the effects of artificial EMFs, electromagnetic fields, uh, are uh, on cells. And it's a proven scientific study. Uh, and all our products you see here are being produced in order to give you at home uh, an environment where you can where you can actually relax and, and calm down in, in the in the, in the contents of also as you see there electromagnetic fields. The, 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 the big advantage of our technology is uh, in, in contradiction to um, people who uh, screen off electromagnetic fields, you know, with copper nets and, and wire uh, surroundings, is that you are still able to use mobile phones, tablets and, and, and notebooks inside of your house, which is um, uh, which you can't when you use those copper mattresses and stuff uh, and shields. So what this does is give you like a protection shield of some sort? Yeah, in some way it's, it's, there's a kind of a good picture of what our belief is. Um, the natural spectrum of the sunlight is necessary for any kind of living being. Uh, you, you have to, you need it. And anything that is, or everything that is being produced artificially, man-made, electricity in general has an, has an impact on your body system. And these frequencies are neutralized. They're not, like, gotten rid of. They're still there. So you can still use your mobile phone and stuff, but it doesn't have the... It doesn't, your body doesn't go into resonance with these artificially made frequencies. And that is the basic idea of all of our products. Huh? It, is, it, is, actually, it is quite unique. It doesn't work with other higher frequencies. Like, for example, you have a, you have a, a, a mobile phone mast in the vicinity of your home, and it has a frequency of, let's say, uh, 670 gigahertz. So we don't add another frequency on top, you know, to, to overlay it. So it, we, we, we don't do anything like that. We don't energize, you know. We don't put extra frequencies onto your body system, which would be contradictory. What we do is we um, we neutralize the information of this frequency. This is not a magnetic thing, something like that. It is the, uh, the, the yeah, kind of rubber, natural rubber. And there is uh, silicon. A powder baked inside, and uh, the information you need to kind of neutralize the the artificially made frequencies is being it's like a it's like a layer you know there's three layers of silicon powder and this natural rubber and uh, it is baked together um, and you wear it as I said you wear it I wear it while traveling or while being here on a fair this for example this year product. It is um, it's for your apartment. It's it's up to a size of 100 square meters. We have uh, industrial plants equipped with this kind of, of product, uh, 170,000 square meters. Uh -huh. well, yeah, so big production plants. Is so, there some type of uh, rare earth element within this? No, no, no there's no. not. Because I know that some of them use that. No. It's not like uh, rare earth elements being produced in China and stuff like that. No, this is silicon quartz. Yeah. It's silicon. And uh, there's a program, a range of frequencies on it. Okay. Is that what that is? No, this What's is the, that the design, design of life. Oh, they're just... Is it religious? No, it's more esoteric. Huh? But it also has a strength to it. You know, there's mm -hmm. people in Germany that have this picture uh, for example, on the window pane uh, to give extra strength to the house or to the habitat. Uh, it is it is part of the of the overall gen uh, information. This, information. This it's a form of yeah, information. Yeah. Is what it, is. it is an information technology, yes. basically. It's appealing to me. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Uh, and what is that? The memorizer food. Oh yeah. Something quite interesting. Um, 
if you if you go into a restaurant, um, you know, if you, if you cook at home, mm -hmm. you 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 will you, sh you obviously are sure that you either are using or not using a microwave or in induction oven. Huh? Mm -hmm. uh, you know induction? Induction? Yeah. So um, this food cart here, you basically place. Uh, if you go to a restaurant tonight, mm -hmm. you place it under your your, your dinner plate? or your plate for two minutes. Or this is or I guess it's already for one minute. I'm not sure if it's here or a new one. And the the negative information of the microwave oven, the heating oven, stuff like that, will be neutralized. So if you buy a really cheap orange juice, you know, like a liter for 19 cent, European cent, and it is a really strong acid to it. And you put this under, you have two glasses, and you put it under one glass for a minute, and then have somebody try both glasses uh, of orange juice, he would definitely uh, taste the difference, because it changes the information of the acid. Uh, this I've is all these kind of things before, um, in, like for food that's devitalized, or mm -hmm. perhaps that it's you know, grown with GMO type of food, or yeah. or pesticides uh, that it in some way helps to neutralize that. Is that it, right? Definitely, definitely. It, it doesn't it doesn't uh, filter the pesticides or anything out of the, the, the dish, the dinner, but it neutralizes the information. The information that's, yes. that is what our technology is about.